Morgan, you were right. All those cows are absolutely terrified. Sandwich? Sure. What kind? Spleen. Beef spleen. Sure. Great. Uh, a small one. How's your hand? It's numb. Some of the nerves are crushed, I expect. Oh my god. Well, at least the throbbing stop. If it's not right in a week or so, I'll, I'll get it removed. Wait, you'll... Government will give me a hook or something. So how are things in the barn? Uh, well, I sat there for a long time watching your cows. One of them, a brown one. Uh, which brown one? Uh, bow-legged brown one or the brown one smells like a wet sweater? The bow-legged one, I Ooh, guess. Daisy. She kept trying to turn around to look at me. I think she thought I was coming to choose the next one to get, you know. She, she looked me in the eye. She, Daisy, has these eyes that are like brown tennis balls. She stared and stared right at me for a long time. It felt like we exchanged something. Daisy's not next, is she? Afraid so. Jeez. Mm. You said this was beef? It tastes like ham. It's because we feed the pigs to the cows. Really? Well, not the whole pig. <laughs> what is it like? being around death and rebirth all the time, to, to grow things and kill things for a living, year in and year out. You've been here how long? Moved here in 42. So for 30 years you've been doing this, planting, nurturing, nourishing, building up, and then harvesting, reaping, destroying, eviscerating. Uh-huh. Well, it must be difficult. I mean, you grow wheat and corn out of the dirt, out of literally nothing, and then you cut it down and you sell it. You, you raise animals, feed them, house them, name them and then you kill them and eat them. Uh-huh. What is that like? How does that make you feel? Miles, it's an emotional roller coaster. 